It's July 20th on a Saturday. The N MSC Cruise liner just came in. And uh, it came in, it comes in at 8 and leaves at uh, 2. So the passengers basically have, what, six hours to, to see Dubrovnik. <laughs> but not even because they have to get there to the old town. So getting there and back leaves them about four hours to see the, the town. It's kind of ridiculous. I mean, it takes two hours to do the wall. And then if you're going to sit down and have lunch, you just have no time to see the city. A lot of the cruise ships come in in the morning and leave at 10 o'clock at night. But this guy, he leaves at 2, which is crazy. So today we're going to go to the Modern Art Gallery uh, of Dubrovnik. It's close to the old town. And then we'll go take, catch a bus to the beach again. Those beaches are pretty nice. They're on, see that hill right here? The bus goes along the harbor and it goes over that hill and, it's, and the beaches are on the other side of the hill. So they're pretty nice beaches. Much nicer than the, the beach in town by the old town. That's way too crowded. Oh, I see. Oh, look at these people. Oh, they're waiting for their their shuttle back to the tour uh, to the uh, cruise ship. Oh my God! Excuse me. Saturday. It's like jam today. Fortunately, we're not going inside. We got to walk up to the art gallery. So this how this is how the fort looks from the bottom. So if you were trying to attack the fort, you'd have to scale those walls under the fire of the guys on top. They're pretty tough. Pretty tough. So even if you made it over the this first wall, they have the double walls. So you get out of the first wall and you find you're trapped on between the two walls. Then you get run over by a bus. <laughs> Actually, that's their first line of defense: is the tour buses. Now there's a nice boat. I think they actually sail. I'll have to look that one up on the internet. Beauty. Did I mention this was someone's home? This is their terrace. So they turned it into a sculpture garden. I'm sure they have some nice fundraising cocktail parties up here. Oh yeah. Yeah, these are for flags.
Here's the open foyer as you come in. Sculpture's a little strange. Looks like the survivors of more than the survivors of Pompeii victims. This is the hallway from the foyer, just down here, to the upstairs room. This grouping. Yes, that's very And I like this Yes, this whole grouping is very nice. This house is incredible. Yes. Once again, the museum's empty and cool. You want to get away from the crowd? Go to the museums. This 
is the door to the gardens. Yeah, this one was from 2013. These are recent works. Here's one from 2001. Look at the view from the bedroom window. You know, the view of that small house yesterday, though, the patio was better than this. That was, you could see the city and the sea. Hard to, yeah, I wouldn't turn down either of them. Here's a private house next door on the nice patio. Laundry. Oh, laundry. They don't have dryers. Uh, in, we haven't run into any dry electric dryers or gas dryers. Everyone uh, hangs their laundry. Why waste the energy when they have so much sun? Two thousand and eleven. These are all pretty recent works in here. Yeah, these are uh, here's nineteen ninety eight, and then nineteen eighty. These are from the eighties. You could tell his palette has changed. These are much more subdued. From his recent work, 1982, 1987. Oh, no, oh, no. Well, we made it to the beach. Very nice place. It's a big hotel. Like I say, can't have private beaches in Croatia, so the hotels have to uh, offer umbrellas for rent for anybody that comes here. So you go to a fancy hotel and you get a Rent for ten bucks for the two chairs and the umbrella. There goes our boat. Left at two o'clock. It's on its way. That boat starts in Venice and it goes to a bunch of cities, seven days. But it only stops at each city for about seven or eight hours. It's crazy. Um, should be sailing overnight. This is a nice beach. <laughs> sailing from the past. Just like it used to look, except they had the sails down. Thank <laughs> you.